Across the world, people use bananas and plantains for cooking, roasting, and brewing. Peelings of the fruit and chopped pieces of the stem are used as feed for livestock. But bananas and plantains have a big enemy, the banana weevil. The banana weevil is a small black insect with a long curved snout. Plants attacked by the banana weevil grow slowly and produce small fruits. In this video, we will learn how this pest develops, how you can spot its presence, and why it is important to use clean planting materials when starting new banana fields. Then we will learn how to control banana weevils in your banana field. Female weevils lay their eggs inside the base of the banana stem just above ground level in the upper part of the comb or in cut stems left after harvesting. The weevil eggs hatch into larvae or grubs that feed and tunnel into the comb and the stem. The tunnels block the flow of water and nutrients in the stem, thereby preventing normal growth of the banana. As weevil larvae grow in size, they make larger tunnels in the stem and finally tunnel their way out to pupate in the soil near the comb. The tunnels weaken the stem, which may break at the base or in the middle. From the pupa, small weevils emerge after five to seven days. Having seen how the banana weevil develops, how can we tell there are banana weevils in our field? Banana plants attacked by weevils bear small bulges. When weevils have attacked your plants, you can also see the leaf sheath split. There will be tunnels in the stems and combs, and stems often snap. Banana weevils only move short distances and rarely fly. Banana weevils spread to new fields, mainly through infested planting materials. When planting new banana fields, make sure to use clean planting materials so that weevils are not transferred with infested suckers. Use young suckers where weevils have not made tunnels yet. <laughs> Any sucker, if you like the banana plant to come out very well, it must be big at the bottom and thin at the top. The leaves come out very small, but any sucker when it starts by bringing out round leaves at the bottom is a wrong one. After having checked its shape, you uproot the sucker and cut off all its roots. If it does not have holes of those weevils, you know that one will be good. Because if you take a sucker with banana weevils, you will transfer weevils from one garden to another one. Clean all planting materials in the fields where they are obtained so you do not transfer weevils from old to new fields. Remove all leaves, roots, and all dead parts of the plants so that the suckers look clean and display the true color of the comb. Immediately plant the cleaned suckers so that they are not attacked by weevils before planting. Let us now look at how farmers in Uganda control banana weevils in their banana fields. After planting banana suckers, maintain good soil fertility and high moisture content in your banana field to get strong plants that can resist pests and diseases. 
add manure to the banana plants every season. Put the manure two feet away from the banana stool so that banana roots do not grow close to the surface. Keep your banana field mulched. Mulching helps maintain soil moisture. The mulch should be placed two feet away to discourage weevils from infesting the banana stool. Weevils are attracted to moist places, so do not place mulch in the heart of the stool. Keeping mulch away from the stool helps divert most weevils from the banana stool. Because the banana weevil likes cool places very much, I put them out in my plantation two feet away from the banana stool. If I put them close to the banana stool or nearby or in the heart of the banana stool, the banana weevils would reproduce within the banana stool. But if you put them about two feet away from the banana stool, banana weevils look for that moist place and will stop there. Lay their eggs there and reproduce there. Freshly cut stems and combs are particularly attractive to weavers. After every harvest, split the stem into small longitudinal strips, sheath by sheath, and spread them out to dry quickly. Splitting the stem reduces breeding sites for weavers and makes weevil eggs and larvae to dry out. It also helps to reduce hiding places for weevils. The split stem pieces should be laid two feet away from the banana stool. When you harvest bananas and notice that a stem has many circular tunnels, the stem is infested. Chop it up and feed the pieces to your animals. After harvesting, you can also use the cut stain to make banana weevil traps. When I trap these weevils from my banana plants, I take all of them while they are still alive or than they are. I then burn them to make sure they are dead. That is better than using chemicals in the banana plantations. Because when you use chemicals, some weevils die, but others remain alive, and they continue laying eggs and reproducing, and they continue destroying your bananas. Let us see how to make and use such traps. Cut the stem in short pieces of one foot each. Split the one foot pieces longitudinally into halves and place them over a cut banana leaf with the split surface on the banana leaf. Alternatively, cut the stump from which the banana was harvested at ground level and place a stem sheath on top of the stump. The freshly cut smell of the stem will attract weevils to the traps. Check the traps every other day. Collect weevils from the traps and destroy them by throwing them in the fireplace. The traps remain effective for one week during the dry season and two weeks during the rainy season. Make new traps wherever you harvest bananas. Let us revise what we learned. Banana weevils are small black insects which feed and turn into the comb and the stem as such blocking the flow of water and nutrients. To control banana weevils, use clean planting materials when starting new banana fields. Remove all leaves, roots and dead parts of the planting materials. Every season, add manure and mulch two feet away from the banana stool.
split harvested stems into long strips and spread them out to dry two feet away from the banana stall. After every harvest, make weevil traps and check them every other day. Collect the weavers and destroy them. Do not wait. Control banana weavers now so they do not destroy your bananas. Thank you.